I'm now going to demonstrate how to find acronyms in your work because perhaps you're required to um, give a list of abbreviations and acronyms perhaps, okay? So here you might um, add your, your acronyms. So what you're going to do is you're going to open the find window. So either you can go to edit um, at the very top of your page, or you can go to review, click on reviewing, and then click this um, find button. What you need to do is click on this cog for settings and then advanced find and replace. And you need to make sure that the following is inputted. So this won't be a default. Um, you need to make sure that use wild cards is checked, that you input exactly this um, code here um, with no spaces at all. And then you highlight all items found in main document. Okay. And it says that it's found six items matching this criteria um, and that it's finished looking at them for you, okay? Um, so, when you do that, if you click find all, what you can do thereafter is you can scan through your document and find the, um, the acronyms. So, for example, we have SS, COF, again, we have COF. Um, so, when you do your list of abbreviations, you can then put those into that, that list. You don't need to use where it has abbreviated the, the Roman numerals for the chapter. Um, but for the remainder, you would do that. Um, if I just click on this button here on the left hand side, it's a document map, which will help you navigate through your document. Um, so let's say that I want to quickly get to my um, list of abbreviations. Okay. Here, what I can do is um, add a table, perhaps. And I can put my abbreviations in there. So it highlighted to me that I had COF and I can put choice of font, okay? Now, when you do this, um, you might choose to perhaps change the style of that. So you remove the, the color in the lines. You might choose to see that it has no borders at all, okay? So you can do that here. Um, and it might just make it look perhaps a bit smarter, okay? Um, so you can do that. Make sure that when you um, are formatting your list of abbreviations at the end, you um, make sure that your list of abbreviations are in alphabetical order. So let's say I say ABC means alpha, uh, Charlie, something like that, okay? What I need to do is I need to make sure that I go here, I click this button at the top, and then I click OK, and it will automatically put them in alphabetical order. So that's really important because it's um, the way that typically your readers will navigate these kind of tables. 